Hello and welcome to Apex Instant Tips, episode number 177, brought to you most Fridays at 12.05 Eastern Time. I'm Anton. And I'm Marwa. Hi, Anton. Hi, Marwa. Good to see you again. Thank you. Thank you. So what do we have going on today, Marwa? So today we will talk about code reviews. Okay, so um, we have many code reviews, asynchronously code reviews, but once a week we have asynchronous code reviews. We meet with a developer and that's done randomly. So that's an opportunity to meet and um, present or share technical information. Yeah, it's great for me because it, it's a way for me to meet all of the consultants and, and take a look at what they're doing. So I, I really enjoy those um, and I'm, I'm glad we do them. Yes, and um, at the beginning of the code review, we also chit chat a little bit to get to know more about the other person that we're doing the code review with. And yeah, then, that's part um, of our agenda. They actually, it, it's, on these particular code reviews, we actually on the agenda have the first five minutes is chit chat. Yeah. Yes, and enjoy, I really enjoy those uh, for f five minutes a lot. And um, I noticed something else is that. It's always the same first five minutes with you, Anton, when we are doing a code review with you for the first time. So, um, oh, you mean you mean after the chit chat? After the chit chat, yes, when we start, uh, when we actually start the code review. So um, today, let's make a code review together. I'll be the developer, and I'm sharing now my screen. Okay, yes. well, it was really nice to have that first five minutes to chat with you, Mara. I was really happy to hear about all of your cats. Um, but we should probably get in on this code review. Uh, hi, Juno. Yes, uh, let's get in. Yeah. Um, well, I'm going to invite everyone. I'm going to take one minute before we do this. I meant to do this earlier. Please log into your Apex Development Workspace while we're talking because you can follow along. And this code review, I'm going to be doing a code review on everybody that's watching. I'm code reviewing all of your code right now. So we're gonna take 30 seconds more. We're gonna let everybody get logged into your workspace, get to the same space that Marwa is. And I think if I'm not wrong, this code review is gonna be for everyone and we'll see how it goes. Marwa, anything we should talk about for 20 seconds? Well, can you see the yellow, the yellow part here, the extensions? Can you remember oh, what? Right. I don't remember what episode that was, do you? But it was one of our instant tips. Is how it to was. Write. Yeah. Yes, yeah. But I don't remember like which episode. Yeah. And at the top right, that one too. Yeah. Exactly. That's another instant tip. Right. So, um, okay. Well, hopefully, our vast user audience has now got logged, gotten logged into their Apex Builder. They're on the same page as us. So let's go ahead. Oh, we're not even going to turn on a timer because this tip is going to be so fast, we won't even need a, tip, a timer. So, there we go. Um, okay, Marwa. Well, great. This looks great. Um, well, let's take a look. What uh, what application are you working on? Yes. So, I'll go to my app builder. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, already I have a piece of advice for you. I don't even know what application you're working on, and I already have a piece of advice on this code review. Um, what I want to do, these cards don't show me enough information. I want you to click on the list view. Okay. And right oh. away, I want you to add a few columns. I want to know what the authentication scheme is and um, what the uh, page uh, security, application security scheme is as well, the second one. I, I want to see these all the time because I think they're important that they always show up. Um, and then there may be other things that you <coughs> always want to see, but these are two that I, I always want to be on this page. So I'm going to have you add those in. Great, yes. Great, before you go any farther, I want you to save this report just as it is right now. Okay. And by saving this report, the next time you come into the builder, it will already be there. Um, because Apex saves your preference. Um, you might remember uh, episode number 173, we talked about user preferences. That's actually a user preference in your workspace for this application, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, it knows your preference right here. Um, Excellent. Uh, so good. So what application are you working on? So AIT-161. OK. This application. Oh, wait. Yeah. I already have another piece of advice. <laughs> right here, these cards don't give me enough information either, right? So could you change this to list view? And can you Absolutely. guess what columns? Can you guess what columns I'm going to have you add? OK. So let's see. 
authorization scheme. Yep, for sure. That. Protection level. Protection level, yep. I'd also like to see pages public. And you can add any other ones that you want, but I think page mode is another one that I like to see. Okay, page mode, okay. Right. This and, you one. Know, you don't, maybe you don't need that one, that's up to you, but apply that change. I, definitely those security ones. Go ahead and apply that change. Um, because now it will stand out to you. Every time you go to click that one icon with authorization scheme right to the right of it, you'll know, wait a minute, oh, wait a minute, that page mm -hmm. doesn't have an authorization scheme. And it probably should. Now, I, I don't know, it depends on your application, but these are things that I wanna see all the time. Next step, save that report. Yes. All right, there we have it. That's, that's my tip. Do you have anything to add to that, Marwa? Um, yes, this is so helpful to me. I would choose to add another column, I think, the comments column to my report so that I can, because we use this attribute to um, mention important comments about the tasks. Where is it? Oh. Okay, I have to scroll. There it yep. is. Right, because you've got your screen uh, plussed up for people to see. Um, Angel actually gives a really uh, good tip here as well. Um, he suggests you might want to order by updated, so you see the most recently updated things at the top. I think that's a great idea. I actually do that on mine as well. So the updated column, you can switch that to be descending. You could do that in your applications as well. It tends to make things easy to find. Um, yeah, so you can save that new one. Um, <laughs> So, yes, Fernando, exactly right. Um, so, uh, let's see. Great. Um, so, great. Now we have our, and, and you can have multiples of these, but whichever one you were last on is going to be what you come to when you're there. Um, th that is today's tip. Oh, you know what, Marwa, we talked a little bit. There's one other little thing that you pointed out to me, and that's that under shared components, you can actually put an application comment. Um, Marwa yes. pointed this out to me just earlier today. Um, and so here, you can put whatever you want for a comment in your application. And as far yes. as I know, there's only one place, go ahead and put anything you want there. There's only one place that you can see this within the builder, except uh, other than going here. Um, and what's that one place, Marwa? I'll go back to the list of application in the app builder. Mm -hmm. I have my custom report. This one, yes, I think that's the one. Mm -hmm. Oh, there yes, you. there it is. Right. So another place that uh, that you can do. So so that really, you're right, Marwa. That is usually the first five minutes of every code review that I do with somebody that I haven't done with it with before. Of course, if I've done it with them before, it better already look like this. <laughs> yes. Um, all right, so a little bit of a little bit of a, a boring tip, but one that I think is really pretty important and, and super helpful. Um, you know, once once you start saving this, you'll uh, you'll get there. Um, yeah, Rich, that is funny. Um, well, um, I do have a wisdom of the week. If you you know came around just for the tip, you can beat it now. But uh, I have a wisdom of the week that's related to a few weeks ago. I mentioned a New York Times article. Uh, an author had had um, uh, given uh, a number of things that she has learned from people she's interviewed. She's a New York Times uh, columnist and a number of things that she's learned from people she's interviewed about just making your life happier, more enjoyable. And I like this. This is, this is one that she had. Um, and the, the recommendation was uh, have silly family rituals. And it, just by coincidence, the ritual that she gave is kind of similar to a ritual that my family already has. Her ritual was that her, I think it was her daughter, one of her children didn't really like meatloaf, um, but you know, it's easy for them to make, so they make it occasionally. And as a way to sort of make it more palatable, whenever they have meat, meatloaf, they put a candle in it, they light the candle and they sing happy meatloaf to you. <laughs> <laughs> kind of silly. This is a happy ritual. Yeah, well, so my family, I, a ritual that I do is whenever I make pasta, 
um, it doesn't matter what kind of pasta I'm making, whatever I'm, I'm making pasta, I grab a single piece of, of fusilli pasta and I throw it in with the rest of the pasta. And then whoever gets the piece of fusilli with their meal is the winner. They win. Um, oh, that, so you have a winner. It's so pasta meal. That's yes, great. Yes. Um, and I haven't done it, but, and my kids are all adults at this point, but I've, I've, um, they always ask me uh, all the time, what do we win? I'm like, mm, that, you're just the winner. Uh, but I've, I've always joked about making a crown out of pasta, you know, gluing pasta to a crown, you know, a piece of paper for a crown and telling them that they could, uh, could wear the crown. So, uh, you can have that, you can have that piece of advice for free. Thank you. I like that. You will have a king or a queen. Yeah. That's great. So that's it. Um, we have a perhaps record-breaking uh, Apex Instant Tip this week. Uh, we are out of here. Uh, people have wasted a perfectly good 11 minutes uh, with us today. Uh, but if you liked the show, like the show, do all the things. Subscribe. Send a letter to your mom about the show. All those. Great talking to you again, Marwa. Thank you, Anton. Bye. Bye, everyone. Thank you.